Hey everyone, welcome back. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Layla Peron and I upload videos three times a week on fashion, beauty, and empowerment. So if that's something you're interested in, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, click that notification bell so that you know every time I upload a video. How's everyone doing today? Week five, I'm on week five of isolation and uh, you know, we're just chugging along. Got a case of the Mondays a little bit, so I thought I'd go glam with the makeup and Put myself in a better mood and it and it has changed for sure and today i am rocking this beautiful headband which i'm probably not wearing it totally the right way still figuring it out but this headband is handmade by my good friend desiree burgess alford who runs a business called hearts and pearls and she's got tons of beautiful turban like headbands and other different kinds of cloth headbands so i'm going to link her in the description below please go check her out she is a small business owner she's a mom and a wife of um three beautiful kids and i know it would help her out greatly if uh, you could do some online shopping that's of course if you have the money and um, the space to do that so today's video as you can see by the title we are going to talk about bras 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 yay <laughs> Obviously, bras are a, a important, integral part of every woman's wardrobe. And, well, if you're small enough to not have to wear a bra, like, amazing, hats off to you. I wish I could function in this world like that. Unfortunately, I cannot. I have always been big-chested my whole life, and it's kind of been a, a point of contention for myself and my self-image. You know, I, I had self-confidence issues growing up. I was very keen on minimizing my bust area. How can I make things look smaller? I was very uncomfortable in my own skin. You know, my chest was a big part of that. It was always difficult to do bra shopping because I would often find like granny style bras where they were just not attractive looking. I mean, they served the function, but in terms of aesthetics, they were just not very pretty or sexy or didn't make me feel very good about wearing them. It was purely for function until about, I'd say 12 to 15 years ago even, a friend of mine at the time recommended this brand to me and it's called Bravissimo. It is a UK based brand, although they do ship to the US and they do have a US website and they have opened one store in Soho, I believe in New York City. And they have designed bras for sizes larger than D. So it's, I believe it's D through K cup is what they, uh, what their range is. I myself, am a 32 H. Um, which I know it's like a crazy number down the alphabet. You wouldn't think that bras went that far, but they were even bigger when I was pregnant and it was just crazy. Like it, it's been a struggle trying to style my looks, how to wear things without looking too provocative, without looking too, too sexy, too, you know, boobies out. Um, that's not my style generally at all. And so, you know, there's kind of a different set of rules for women who are bigger chested because it's very easy to look sort of trashy without even um, really doing too much. So, you know, finding this brand has been a godsend. They are not the cheapest. I will say that um, the average bra can run you anywhere from $60 upwards. But, you know, this is an investment in your, in your undergarments. And one thing to keep in mind is, you know, your whole look or whatever clothing you're wearing is not going to look its best unless you have the right undergarments. So just like we talk about not wanting to see panty lines when we're wearing leggings or any sort of see-through fabric, it's just as important that you have the correct support, that you are sized correctly for your chest size, for your bust, and you're comfortable, right? I know that bras are not necessarily the most comfortable thing, but they should be as comfortable as possible for you to be able to function in your daily life, look good, feel good, and be able to carry on without thinking about things digging into you, you know, tightness around your chest or anything like that. Let's talk about these bras. They come in an array of sizes, like I said. Let me show you one of them here. This is a beautiful um, what they call balconette bra. So it does have underwire. I am more comfortable with an underwire bra. I know a lot of people are against underwire bras just because they feel like it digs in. However, these bras don't dig in. I, I, you know, I'm a bigger cup size as you can see. 
I think this could like fit on my head <laughs> as a hat. <laughs> That's how big they are. But you know, there's beautiful lace detailing here. You know, they have, um, you know, they pay attention to all these kinds of things. You know, they understand that women want to feel sexy and not all of us want to have just the basic black and nude bras. So this is one of them. Look all the details below. This is Bravissimo's own brand, but they do carry other brands, some of which you'll see in U.S. department stores like Waco, and I think I've even seen Panache. And here's another one of the bras, and, and I just want to show you these as an example of the kinds of beautiful patterns and colors that you can get. That's one thing that you don't have to sacrifice on, is style and beauty. You know, everyone wants to feel beautiful, even if it's something that's just for yourself. You know, you're single, it's not like you're trying to show your bra off to your partner or anything. You know, everyone has the right to feel that way, whether anyone else can see it or not. Here is another one. So they come in an array of sizes, so many colors. They do have bra and panty sets. Here is my strapless bra, which yes, they make strapless bras. Do you see all these like, um, like supports, like built-in supports, you know, and, and this is movable, right? Okay, so it's not going to stab you uh, and you're not going to constantly have to pull the bra up. You know, I know we all have had those issues no matter what size you are with strapless bras. This does come with a strap and then you just um, detach it here and these straps come right off. So you can do strapless, you can have it racer back style, you can do the, if you have a one shouldered top, you know, you can just have one strap on. As you can see, they have these little grip silicone um, pieces put on this. So that helps the grip stay in place. It's all across the bra. You can see there's extra built-in support along the cup line with these, again, grooved plastic pieces that are inserted to create the lift and keep the lift up. Again, here's another style in this beautiful mauve minky color. They come see-through. Most of the bras that I have are not t-shirt bras. You know, things are not totally even, so I had a tough time finding a t-shirt bra, but these bras serve just as well. Um, they are a little bit sheer, so, you know, your nipples may show. If that's something that concerns you, you know, there are stickers that you can buy. Like I said, I don't know if it's after having children, I just kind of like don't care or or what, but I am like not concerned about bra showing, nipple showing, like it really makes no difference to me. And I think we are in a phase of of our society where it's kind of, it's, it's okay. Like you can show whatever you want to show, like whatever makes you happy, you know? Um, here's another gorgeous red colored bra that looks great under my sort of sheer red t-shirts that I have. Again, very comfortable. Every bra has at least three hooks, if not four. So as you can see, I did want to mention that these straps are thinner. You know, these are an average bra strap size. They, they do have some that are thicker, but what they do mention, and I didn't realize this until I start, started shopping at Bravissimo, is the fact that actually a majority of the support for your bra, no matter what size you are, should be coming from the band. Okay, your cup and your band should be supporting you fully. And you shouldn't be dragging a majority of the weight on the strap. You know, you get the the dig in from the straps. That shouldn't be happening. That is telling you that your bra is probably a little bit too big in the band. So either size down, you know, go to the smaller sizes on your um, hooks or buy a new bra. It might be time to buy a new bra. I know I definitely need to buy some new ones. Here's a pink one that I wear. This is um, one of my favorite styles where it's got the uh, a little bit of lace detailing at the top. This is this is the Bravissimo brand, um, but some of these are different <clears throat> different brands. This is another bestseller where it's got this like houndstooth print on it. Uh, also a little bit sheer. I have this in white. I have it in black and this is panache. So this is a different brand um, From Bravissimo that is carried on other sites, but I know that Bravissimo carries the largest sizes on their website um, And then one more bra that I wanted to show you is um, This one here. This is my plunge bra so you can see 
how deeply cut that is right here with the beautiful lace detailing that allows for a super deep plunge. It's got a pretty little, um, what do you call this? Like a charm here in the middle. Um, well, it's kind of like just something for you, you know? So, um, like I said, they have a range of styles. They do have a sports bra. I do have their sports bra. I think it, mine is in the wash, but it gives me an immense amount of support. It kind of like, uh, it kind of looks, it, it is like a sports bra top, you know, that some women wear, but it is very supportive. It's got a Velcro strap. It's got the, um, the hooks as well. And I just feel very secure in it. I don't have to worry about, you know, holding my bra up here if I want to run or do some sort of jumping exercise. I'm really not concerned. You know, it has allowed me the ability to wear lots of different style tops, you know, as, as people who are bigger chested will know, you know, wearing something sleeveless, wearing uh, one, one shoulder tops, it, it's like a nightmare trying to navigate how you're going to wear that or whether you're just going to show your whole bra and not care or have to wear a cami over something. So this brand is really a, a great solution for those of you out there who are bigger chested and who need some supportive solutions where you don't have to sacrifice on style. So one great thing about this brand is that I do look proportional. You know, people are often surprised when I tell them my size just because um, I'm supported so well and my, my chest is lifted. And somebody did tell me that your bra or your chest should run in between your upper arm and your elbow. So, so if your chest is going down below here, that means that your chest is going too low and you need some support to lift those girls up. I'm so happy to share this information. I mean, honestly, it's been a real struggle pretty much from high school onwards to find something that fits me, that makes me feel good, that gives me that self-confidence and, uh, and doesn't make me feel self-conscious about what my natural gifts are, if you will. But that's all I have for you today, guys. I hope you're all doing well. Hope you had a lovely weekend. Stay healthy, stay safe, stay at home, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.